friends and welcome to the video for the general collective for the week and I hope all of you are doing amazing thank you for tuning in so I'm gonna go ahead and see what's popping up in the cards for the collective for this coming up week we are in cancer season fourth house we did have the moon in cancer and the Sun a very powerful time so we have Somebody is being very specific, and the problem is other people are connecting to this. So it could be picky, it could be learning, investigating other people, relationships are a part of a problem, actually, in this. Ooh, somebody is telling, being very direct and honest, straightforward, maybe cutting someone out um, with the King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What do we have here? Ooh, a new pentacle is given. An ace of the coin. Could be signing documents. There could be a celebration. I mean, three of cups could be a celebration energy. What's coming up in the future position? Yeah, four of swords. You're not, you're probably cutting someone out of this scenario. Um, what is your energy is the wheel of fortune things are changing um, faded changes oh okay you also have a ten of Pentacles a lot of money coming in a very solid foundation maybe houses property loans money coming in for you so I'm thinking here that this since they all came out at the same time we have something changes and you get a new offer when you haven't heard from someone about this offer queen the empress card um some kind of matriarch a mother energy what is this here you're wanting four of coin to hold back hold on and what is the final outcome here for the collective the emperor taking back your power two of cups there's a relationship so you are owning your power, knowing who you are, very solid, very stable, Aries energy. So we have Aries, we have Aquarius, Ten of Pentacles, we do have the Hangman. Something is submerged, stuck, or hanging in the balance. Somebody could feel uncomfortable in that type of an energy, but what is the wheel coming in for the change? The Harvent. Somebody's coming forward being nice. But there is some kind of procedure or decision, ethical decision made in your favor. Okay, so you get the Ace of Coin, the Hierophant. What is the Emperor as the outcome? Ooh, we have Justice coming in for the Collective. Something is being made fair, balanced, equal. Um, we have something coming in that is like enforcement of truth. What is justice and the emperor about? A tower. Wow. So we have something shocking or surprising. Unexpected. What is the Hierophant and the change? What is the Hierophant and the change? Page of Wands. Somebody's very excited, thrilled. Some really exciting news. We do have some kind of Five of Swords energy that you don't see. Somebody could behind the scenes could be jealous of this we have an emperor and an empress there could be executives people who are leaders um, your energy is getting a ten of pentacles so you're coming into quite a bit of abundance here why is there a five of swords secretly somebody feels quite angry at someone that they haven't expressed so there is something here with the high priestess seven of fire somebody feels like they have to defend their position and then a five of swords they feel kind of angry about that but let's see what is the ten of pentacles for the viewer stability the happy home um you have something arriving for you that brings stability into your life a good job a nice a good relationship what is this ace of coin a two of cups you're in an agreement with someone you offer your cup of emotions they offer theirs okay so what is this tower about then three of pentacles people are agreeing and working together and there's a fire sign queen aries leo or sag um so we have a mutual agreement 
We do have a Four of Cups. Somebody doesn't like what's being offered because it's not clear. So the mystery in the Four of Cups, rejection. Somebody's trying to compromise, but something is not enough. Okay, so you're given something with the Knight of Coin. Someone, some slow offer. It arrives very slowly. Queen of Water. Somebody's hiding something. Okay, let's just not worry about that for now. <laughs> Okay, so show us what is the emperor and justice with the tower. The world, okay, a great success and a great achievement. What is this four of wands? Six of air, things get easier for you. Staying out of conflict. Emperor, taking back your power. This could be an Aries reading. I mean, this could be a reading for anyone in the collective. Okay, what is this upcoming wheel turning? Walking away, a matriarch of feminine, divine feminine. This person is walking away or leaving a scenario. Why are you in agreement with someone here? You have good memories and you have a wish coming true here with the Nine of Cups. So there is something to celebrate in this energy, even though it's like something is cut out or removed or decided. What is this tower in the world? Something you've been waiting for with the Three of Wands. The wheel changes coming in. Faded changes. Seven of Cups, Three of Coin. Depending on other people mutually developing, but on Seven of Cups, many things to choose from. The Hermit. Something is discovered or shown and not wanting to give up, not wanting to quit. Very persistent. What is, the, what is this tower about? Page of Cups and a Queen of Coin. You could be getting some news from an Earth sign, a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Feminine. What is, your, what is this person Eight of Cups for? Feeling like leaving. There's a defensive energy. Somebody feels like they have to defend their position. Mars and Leo. We got Taurus, a King of Wands, an Aries, a Leo, Sag, picking up the wand, taking immediate action. Why is this a wish coming true for the collective? Something to do with children, childhood, memories, nostalgia. What is the Emperor about here? Justice again. Okay, so we had justice before. Enforcement of truth, something coming into balance, legal matters, correction. What is the page of wands? Eight of rods, five of coin. What is the page of wands? Not wanting to give up, four of coin. Holding back, holding on. Very persistent, filled with hope. So it looks like justice prevails in this scenario. Seven of pentacles, looking at the value looking at whether something is worth it or not. Show us what the outcome is here for the collective. Queen of Air, Libra. This is Justice again. Lady Justice. Correction. Um, information. Something being made fair. Oh, we got the truth and the Five of Swords. Somebody is angry or jealous or finding out some information about someone who wants to conquer or win. What is coming up in this energy? Last minute decisions, two of rods. And the emperor taking back your power. There could be someone who's in a position of authority. What are you doing here as the viewer? You're in an emperor. Three of cups. Sharing how you feel with others. And there also is a queen of the earth, a Taurus Capricorn Virgo. Sharing your happiness. What is this energy about? The strength and the eight of pentacles. Leo and Virgo. Somebody is very detail oriented, very particular, or very um, uh, like a perfectionist energy. With Leo, brave. Somebody could be investigated in this energy. Okay, two of cups. You're on someone's side. You have a partner, an ally, a friend, a supporter. 
You'll be aware of this Two of Cups and your energy is in a Four of Wands. Your life is stable and happy. Things will be working out for you. What's around the viewer? Fire sign coming and going. And justice being, you know, justice is enforced. Um, King of the Cups, water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Seven of Coins, somebody's looking at the value, whether it's worth it. The Judgment and the Three of Swords, Resurrection, Renewal, Revival. Um, maybe somebody feels judged. There is a Three of Swords with that energy. Okay. So let's see what we're getting for the collective this week. Spirit and Angel Guides. What do we have for the collective? Hostilities. Wow, okay. Uh, second chakra. It has to do with friendships. Adjacent possibilities. The thinking man and envy. Look at this. Like somebody is kind of jealous here. Um, what's going on with this? Pa needing to be patient. A happy family and deception. Huh. Let's get one from the witch's wisdom and see what pops up the, for the collective. needing to establish and set boundaries and it comes out with the card of the summertime so this could be coming up for you uh we got the lord god masculine so we have the high priestess knowing being very spiritual connected to the other side of the veil spirits and angels wiccan ethics which is to harm none to do no harm you can banish, <laughs> but, you know, just to keep someone away from you. But you don't have to intentionally, like, set the intention to cause harm. I have re remembering your ancestors is really important. High Priestess, listen to your intuition. Um, do no harm. Um, the, and establishing boundaries for yourself. Taking back your power. Not giving your power away to someone else. Okay, so what do we have here? Uh, for the collective, what do they? We have two of rods, last minute energy. Feeling like you're at a crossroads. Do I go right? Do I go left? Two of swords, not knowing, feeling like confused. Should I go right? Should I go left? Tuning into your intuition is a good idea with that energy. Page of swords. Listen, somebody could be inquiring, questioning. Watching, spying, seven of cups. Here we go, emperor and a king of pentacles. Somebody is running an empire. Aries energy, overseeing. Just sort of like overseeing things. And then we have this king of earth, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Um, they're coming as a king. They're a leader. Um, the emperor is like on a, kind of on a higher level. So you do have not something new coming in towards you, and you are going to really like what that is. Ace of Pentacles with the Two of Cups. Um, a relationship, a job. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Um, feminine energy, Earth sign, patient. Maybe you're making more money. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. Nine of Coin, independent energy. Page of Cups. Four of Swords, again, it's like cutting off communication, not talking, not speaking, laying down the sword, resting. Um, resting after, like, it's like a truce. Three of Pentacles, shared, dependency, teamwork. The devil, what's the devil about? The truth in the Queen of Air. Somebody tells you the truth. 
I got that a minute ago. That somebody tells you the truth about a situation or a person, and they come in and like let you know this. Queen of the Water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Feminine Energy. I feel like you're going to prevail this week. Um, listen to your intuition. Follow your ethics. And that's what I have for you. Take care. Bye.